Welcome back to Nazareto's channel. I got another video for you guys. It was my Toyota RAV4, a little upgrade. Let me show you the product that I got. But as you see behind me, that's what I'm gonna install. All right, so what I'm gonna install, it's the hood struts for this vehicle. And once you open the hood, the hood is gonna hold by itself. You don't need to put that uh, uh, hood stick. So, it's, you know, you can just let it go and it's gonna hold by itself. This is the product that was sent to me from cartrimhome.com and I will put the link in the description with, with all the information. These are little hood struts. The bracket that goes to be secured on the, on the corners and under the hood. And let's uh, get started here. Let's pop the hood. As you see, you, if you want the hood to be holding, you need that strut right here. This is kind of annoying when you do oil changes or change your filter or overall doing something under the hood. You need to do this, right? It's solid, but I like the struts. So what we're gonna do first, we're gonna get out our 12 millimeters uh, socket. We're gonna remove, remove this bolt right here. This is a driver's side. We're gonna remove this bolt. And on the bottom here, we're gonna remove that bolt right there, driver's side. On the passenger side, do the same thing. Remove this bolt, and then remove the bolt right there, 12 millimeter socket. All right, got my 12 millimeter socket, extension ratchet, this bolt right here. It goes nice and easy. And you're not gonna mess with the hood alignment, there's just one bolt. This bolt is removed. Let's put it in a safe place. Take this bracket now, this one, and this little ball right here is supposed to be facing the inside of the engine, that way. So like this. And we're gonna put the ball back on the middle hole right there. See, the middle hole? We're gonna put the ball back and tighten it up. Our bracket is in, right here, as you see. And uh, as also you see here, a little divot, a little dip over here, goes in against the hood. And we're gonna secure this bolt, like this. We're just gonna secure it with our 12 millimeter. Make sure this bolt is tight, but don't over tighten it. You don't want to break it. And also make sure it's sitting even. Yeah. Flushed against this piece. So this is how it looks. Driver's side, this little ball here looking into the engine. So this is secured. Now we're going to undo that bolt right there. But this extension is too long, so I'm just going to use this part. And uh, let's get that. Hard to get in there, so that's why you need to use a short extension. All right, it's in. Loosen up, and you can do it by hand after you loosen it up. Good, now it goes by hand. Now you're not messing with the hood alignment, nothing at all. Okay, got the bolt. In the next step, we're taking this bracket. As you see, this longer piece. This is for the driver's side, right? So this one we're gonna use to mount to that bolt right there, right there. And this is the, the uh, this is the, for this side, goes like this. We're gonna mount it there. But before you do that, we have to attach the, uh, the little strut. So let's, let's attach the strut. It'd be much easier. See this little pin right here? This little tiny pin. We gotta remove that. We gotta remove it. You just kinda gotta push it in. Yep, don't move. Them. And now we're gonna take our bracket, this bracket, right? And we're gonna secure this bolt joint, push it in. You see, I pushed it in, and then this little tiny hole, that's where our pin goes in. 
and we're gonna push that pin in there. This little pin slides into this tiny hole right there. Do you see it? You push it all the way in. Let's do it. And then kind of twist it and now this part is secure. Good. Let's go install the struts. This little ball right here, you point it towards the engine. And as you see, this longer part also kind of goes forward. Goes in right there. And we're gonna secure it with a bolt, 12 millimeter bolt. I haven't tightened the bolt yet, but make sure this bracket is against this little metal piece. And then now we tighten the bolt. But it's hard to get your hand there. My hands are huge. It's hard to get the hand in there to tighten it by hand first. So you might just use your uh, extension and just start tightening the bolt. All right, that bolt is tight, it's secured. The bracket is not moving. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna remove this little pin on the top and push it in into this ball socket or push it in. So let's get this little thing off. Okay, pin is removed, don't lose it. Now take your hydraulic shock, push it in and it's gonna click. And all we have to left is to push this pin in and this driver side, uh, is, driver, uh, side is done. The strut is in place. So let's find a little hole underneath and push this pin inside. Okay, the hole is on this side. It's kind of hard to do with one hand, but you got the, you got the point. Push it all the way in and twist it and it's gonna be locked. Now, if you're still struggling with this little pin, just remove this bracket and insert the pin on the bottom, push it all the way in and snap it. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna have this part reinstalled in the middle bolt. So we're just gonna reinstall it. All right, so you might need to use a 12 millimeter wrench because the socket will not fit in here. So just use it, secure this bolt on the side, from the side, tighten it up. Oh, it's because this little pin, I couldn't see, couldn't fit it. So I had to dismount this and now I'm gonna secure it again. And the, pass, and the driver's side will be done. Make sure this part is aligning like this against this metal bracket right here. The driver's side is done. Let's remove this hood stand. See if it's holding. It's already holding. I just want to check how it closes. Gives me any issues. Nice. Beautiful. Let's repeat the process on the driver's side. Okay, let's repeat the process on the passenger side. That's what I meant to say. Remove this top bolt, and then remove the lower bolt, then attach the brackets. The hardest part is this lower corner. It's hard to get there. Make sure you have a small extension and ratchet. Okay. Remove this pin on this part right here, just like we did on the other side. And we're gonna install this into this, like a bolt joint. Yeah, we're gonna insert it there. Once you install it, put it together, push the spin in. See? All right, now what we're gonna do, this is how it's gonna look like. This part right here, it's fate, this little bolting is directed towards the engine, just like on the other side. Remember that. Well, let's put this bolt in there and let's start securing it. All right, that side is secured. It was very hard to do it because I have a huge hand, so I can't really fit it. I asked my friend to help me. And now what are we gonna do? Take the spin off and attach the top bracket. Okay, this bracket has to be going like this. See, like this. So that means you have to put this ball joint together and then put a little pin 
and then tighten it up. See, I pushed the pin in one end and now kind of twist it. Okay, let's bolt this part to the middle hole. The middle hole, let's, let's bolt it there. Make sure this facing towards the engine, these bolt little uh, round things, has to set a face towards the engine. See, I put this bolt on the middle hole. Uh, this round, what do we call the joint, bolt joint or shoulder socket, it's facing towards the engine. Same thing in the bottom one, facing towards the engine, right? Now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna tighten it with fingers as tight as I can. And I'm gonna use an open wrench, wrench and we're gonna just tighten it up. All right, I can turn it off. Once you tighten it up, make sure this bracket is aligned against this metal part right here, so it looks nice and even. And you just tighten it up. Almost there. It's getting tighter, it's getting there. You don't want to go too crazy. You don't want to break this bolt. There. Alright, the hood is holding. Let's see how it's close. It's nice and even. Sweet. So now I'm going to open the hood and we're going to see how these shots can hold the hood. Alright. There's a latch right here. Wow, nice. It's kind of push it hard a little bit, but let's see. Nice and easy. Beautiful, guys. No more using this stick. It was so annoying. I'm putting it up. Now I just like you open it, and that's it. We're done. Thank you for watching. Subscribe, hit like, share, whatever you want to do, guys. Thank you for watching. Bye.